BitLocker is a tool that is built into Windows that encrypts your drive, but it can get in the way when you're trying to install an update or something. There are two different ways to disable it. The first one is if you have Windows Pro Enterprise or Education Editions, then you have access to the Group Policy Editor, and you can get it by just hitting Windows and searching for Group Policy, and there it is, Edit Group Policy. And I'll walk you through the file structure on the side here to get to it. So you go to Computer Configurations, then Administrative Templates, then Windows Components, and then BitLocker Drive Encryption, and then double click on Fixed Data Drives. And here you have a small list. Find the one that says Deny Right Access to Fixed Drives Not Protected by BitLocker. Double click on this one. And now you can edit it. So you have three options here, not configured, enabled, or disabled. You want to hit disabled and hit apply or OK and restart your computer for this to take effect. Now, if you do not have access to the group policy editor, you can use PowerShell. Again, hit Windows and just search for Shell and run it as administrator. And here is what you'll need to type in. Disable capital D dash BitLocker with a capital B. This is all one word, no spaces. And then a space dash mount point, capital M and a capital P. And then followed with the letter of your drive. So in my case, if I go into File Explorer, I can see it is C. And then end your quote and hit enter. If you have multiple drives mounted and you want to decrypt all of them that are protected by BitLocker, then enter this command here. Dollar sign capital BLV equals get with a capital G dash BitLocker capital B volume. This is one word BitLocker volume dot space disable with a capital D dash BitLocker with a capital B, this is one word again, and then space dash mount point with a capital M and a capital P, and this is one word, and space dollar sign BLV. And this command will now decrypt all your drives. If you want to know which drives are encrypted by BitLocker, then go to Command Prompt by just hitting your Windows button and typing CMD and run that as administrator. This is the command manage dash BDE all one word space dash status. So here you can see that my C drive is protected percentage encrypted 100% automatic unlock is disabled and so on just give that a quick look over and that'll give you all the drives that are encrypted by BitLocker and exactly what's going on there. And to turn off the encryption from here now, it is just a simple command. So there's multiple ways of doing things. The command again starts in a similar way. So it's again manage dash BDE space dash off space and then the letter of your drive followed by a colon. Commands are a little bit different now because this is uh, command line this is not PowerShell so if you're running into problems with BitLocker or you simply just want to get rid of it the issue should now be resolved but it could still turn itself back on because this is um, Microsoft Windows um, it likes to think that you need these things just like Windows Defender you have to go through quite a process to turn it off and to prevent it from turning itself back on because it's so persistent. If you want to see how to disable Windows Defender, then check out the video on screen now.